Thank you so much. Nothing, nothing. It's just a minor domestic accident. Oh, so sorry. You be careful. <laughs> just so you know, I'm your wedding planner, and nothing is going to happen between us. Just so we're clear. Thank you for the ride. I'm not suffering, I'm just doing my job. Yeah, I know, you can always quit if you don't want these people around. I'm a professional. I won't just quit, I know what I'm doing. I know you are. But having him around will only reopen old wounds. I'm doing just fine. Okay, so how do you breathe around him? I breathe just fine. My goodness, my girls are ready. <laughs> Are you even listening to me? Hmm? Ah, great. What did you say? Eh, I need your help. I can't do this alone. Yeah, you were saying your what? I have 70 people on my guest list. How many are you expecting? Just my parents and my siblings. You can't be serious. So what about your your friends, Philetti, your colleague, everybody? Are they not coming? I mean, everyone has been anticipating this wedding. Just look at my guest list. Seventy. I'm so excited. Yes, I really care about this wedding. What did you say? I said I'll follow your lead. Whatever you decide, I'll do. Me. 
Uh, nobody. He's just a, a client. He's a what? He's a client. Will you shut up? You liar. I'm not lying. He's a, he's a client. I'm planning his wedding. And you expect, you expect me to buy that lie? This is what you do all the time. You probably speak a different name. And you come and you give me the excuses of, of wedding planning and all of that bullshit. Why do you just always think of the worst thing about me? And why won't I think of the worst things about you? Okay, explain it to me. So what does this picture have to do with your wedding planning? With the way you are staring at him lustfully. Explain it. You've slept with him, right? The same way you've slept with different men. All in the name of wedding planning. What is wrong with you? I can't go. I... How dare you? You did please. Thank you, please. Thank you, please, please. I'm sorry, please. I'm sorry, please. I'm You make me look so stupid. How did I go wrong? Annabelle, it's not like that. I was just stressed out in this And see, look. This is important. I need to take this. What in our conversation? Just give me a second. Greg! I'm coming. What's going on over there? Dora, are you crying? Calm down, talk to me. What's wrong? Okay, we can talk about this, all right? You know what? I'm on my way to you. Just calm down. I'll be with you. What's going on? Something urgent just came up. I need to. Why are you in such a hurry? Look, Greg, what is going on? It's an emergency. I need to go. I need to go for real. And you can't even finish before we'll you go. You pick this up. You pick this up when I come back. <sighs> what a beautiful way of apologizing to your wife. I can't continue. I can't plan your wedding. I'm, I'm, I'm stressed. I'm mentally stressed. I, 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 I can't keep trying to fix things and everything just Dora. goes crazy. <sighs> I can't. I need to just drop it. My mental health, I'm, I'm losing my mind. Every day I have migraines. I... <sighs> hey, hey. <sighs> Your body is burning. Do you have do you have a um, like a first aid kit in your house? come back home and act as if nothing happened. Take your call, Greg. Thank you. 
I'm so sorry to call you, but this time of the night. It's just that I want to check up on my husband. Dr. Greg, he's not, he's not home yet. And he's not even taking up his call. Please, is he with you? Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, is the Congrats concert? Oh, okay. Hope it's not what I'm thinking, Greg. Who is not what I'm thinking? Getting too comfortable. Please, you need to go. Okay. But you need to take a lot of water so you stay hydrated. Thank you. And eat. Adora! 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 Dora! Yes? Uh -uh. Calm down. What's the problem? You idiot. Uh -uh. How dare you? How shameless can you be? Michael, what's the problem? So you now bring me into the same house that we share. Michael, come on. I, 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 what are you accusing me of? Did he sleep with you? What? No! What is wrong with you? He, he came. He, he was just che checking on me. I, he was just being caring. I, and I slept up, I, I passed out. Will you shut up and stop sending me that bullshit lie? You think I don't see through you? You pass out my, my, my foot. Can you stop spewing and sending all this? Um, you, you, you portray this pretentious attitude of a good girl that, that you're not. I see through you and I know you very well. So you just stop doing that bullshit whenever you're around me. And now you listen. It isn't the first or last time I will see him in this house or anywhere around you. If it happens again, I swear. Our skin life. And you want to be left out. Shameless. You don't bring men into my own house or into the house I will share. The audacity, the mega and the tongue in that house. If you sell that lie to other people that you sell it to and you think I'm, I'm gonna buy it, I can buy it. Nonsense. There goes His Royal Highness. Babe, good morning. And where are you coming from? Work. Where else would I be coming from? Work. Is she coming from work? Oh, he's coming from work. Which work you don't ask? Because when you refused taking your calls, I called your friend who confirmed you not with him. I called your office and I was told she will not unseat. What are you doing? Stop. Just take a good look at the time you're coming home. Which man about to be married stays out all night? Hey, Greg. 
Annabel, I am not cheating on you. I had a patient, I had a crisis. I had to go to his house. As his family doctor, I had to stay with him and make sure he feels better. He couldn't even make it to the hospital. Was I supposed to be calling you at that time? Or picking my calls? Do you just think I'm stupid? Right? I'm stressed. I don't have time for this. Please, let's not do this. Just take it easy. I'm tired. I'm stressed. This man thinks I'm stupid. <laughs> Adama, please just get up, pack your things, you're leaving this house, you're coming to my house right now. For how long will I run from my own house that I pay for? What are you talking about? This man, oh, you want him to kill you first, is that what you want? He will never change. This relationship is abusive. Michael will never change. Leaving my house is not the solution. Then leave him alone. Yes, leave him alone. But you know it's not that easy. You sound like it's that easy. I owe this guy. You know this thing now. You know this gist. If not for Michael's presence at that scene, I would have died. He gave me his blood. His the blood run. run in my... Okay, continue. I've heard that a million and one times. I mean, that's enough reason. I can't just leave him. I owe him my you life. You owe him nothing. You don't owe him anything. What do you owe him? What? My life. You don't owe him your life. You've done everything for him. You fed him. You gave him a roof over his head. What more do you want? What else do you want to do for him? You know, I... I blame him. Honestly, I blame her. Because if Greg had found me a little sooner, maybe things would have been different. Neka told him I was dead. Okay, in order to regain your legs, I don't think you can leave this man around. If you don't do something, I will do. In fact, I'm going to do it myself. You have to do something about him. Started. Craig has changed. I can't even wrap my hand around what the problem is. You know how these men are. I need to seek you now. What exactly is going on? Please be. He returns when you do it. Always absent. We can no longer have our usual discussions anymore because he's always lost in thought. Adora, I think my husband is seeing another woman, and that's why we need it to be very fast. Very fast. I'm so sorry to hear this. I, well, I'm surprised. I think Greg is kind. He's gentle. How do you know he's kind? I'm gentle. No, no, no. I mean, I... I'm saying you should give him some time. You know, maybe he would... Just give him some time to show you his kindness. He seems kind. You know what? Let's just focus on the wedding. I have come up with a few ideas for your bridal shower.
go to South Wales. Hmm? You've not been talking to your girlfriend. I've been busy now. This is what you've been saying for a while. See, these guys need to get their suit ready. They've been asking what color to go for. Mm -hmm. I'll respond. I'll respond. What, what is happening, Greg? You act like you're not even concerned about this. It's your wedding, bro. You don't have to allow her to do everything. No, no. See, this is Dora. Together and everything, I'm just thinking about old times. Come off it, bro. Come off it. See, you're a married man. I, I mean, I, because you never do traditional marriage. She was also stupid for them together, man. That was their fight. Bro, at this point, it doesn't really matter. She's already living with you. The groomsmen are ready. Her bridal train is ready. Just go ahead and pick the color for the suit. I'm happy deciding with the wedding plan, Asha. Who? Dora. It's the wedding planner now. Just make sure it's strictly business. I hear you. She's my wedding planner, so keep it. Make sure it's strictly business. Please re reply them on that group chat, please. I'll reply now. I got your own two months. Just so okay. reply now. Just send the message to the group now. had happened to my friend, eh? Even though she's an orphan, you would have known that she has a sister. Shameless thing. Blood would have flown to... I'm talking to you. You're not even feeling remorseful for what you did. Useless, man. You're very useless. Parasites! You're a very big, fat, round parasite. That is who you are. Nonsense. Hmm? You don't have respect at all. You come into my house... You're and what? Love. You're what? Your house. Ooh, your house. Adora's house. It is Adora's house, it's not your house. See him swelling up. Oh, yeah, beat me now. Beat me. It is Adora's house. You say it. You say it. You try them again. You wanted to do what? You wanted to punch me. Punch me. Punch me. Punch me. See him swelling up. Like expired pap. Beat me. Punch me. Try it. Useless things, quarter. You still have mouth to talk. You're drinking somebody's <laughs> alcohol. You can't even buy, you can't even afford anything. Nothing you can afford. If you try me, eh, somebody will die here between both of us. And it is you that will go to the mortuary. Let's bet. Nonsense. You're looking at me. You're looking at me. Try this with me. You are lucky I'm not Adora. I would have pierced the into that thing. I will drag it out and break everything out. Hold it for me. Nonsense. See, it's not by height, though. It's not by height. I will. Because you are taller than me. Blood is low here now. You will not come by height. You are lucky I'm not Think about it. <laughs> Just think about it. Think about it for a second. Sorry. It's okay, sorry. Easy. easy. That's not so funny. Uh, there's, there's something uh, she was talking about. It's all this wedding details and yeah, stuff like that. Really? <laughs> yes, so I've come up with a template. I like this one. Yes. Honey. Hmm? The color. Yeah. It's fine. Um, Greg, you haven't picked a color. Why do I need to pick one right here? You're the four. You speak for me already. <laughs> <laughs> I think green would do. Green. 
Mm-mm. Dora, what do you think? Please pick a color. Green will do. Mm -mm. What do you think? You just pick for me. But you suggested green. Yeah, it, we already have too much of it. How about something colorful? White. Like all white. All white party. It's not an angel's party, Greg. <laughs> <laughs> but just, oh, okay, okay, I mean, you're the pro. But I just think that me you know, looking handsome and white would just be... <laughs> I don't like white. I want to be the only one on white. Um, you know, I, maybe we shouldn't do that. I mean, but then let's still go through. Okay, whatever you say. What have I ever done to you? Hmm? Please tell me, what have I done to you, Michael? What? Tell me, please. You know, that's a very rude way to welcome me, you know. What are you talking about? What am I talking about? What are all these debits? Huh? Why are there all these debits? Because I know it's you. So please tell me, what have I done to you? What's wrong with you is that it's that why you're raising your voice. Now, why are you feeling to talk like that? Because I spent your money and that's why you have to talk to me anyway. You like, take your rubbish ATM card. My How God, much did I even spend? This is my work you're toying with. What did you use the money for? Tell me, did you buy something for the house? Did you pay for something important? Why are you raising your voice actually? Why are you being noisy because I spent your money? What's the word with you? How much I even spent for the money? We're basically fooling you talk anyhow. Michael, these are my clients. You have just... What do you expect me to tell them? You know you should be happy that I actually spent your money. How much is there? Then you feel like they talk to you, they talk to me in that way. You're like, see, take your time. I beg you, car rubbish, Jerry, I beg. And don't talk to me anyhow like that again because I spent your money. Take your card. How much? You should be telling me welcome or thanking me and not raising your voice and talking to me anyhow. Scream so the entire neighborhood will hear your voice because I spent your money. She's the one all along. What are you even saying? We were just having a very good conversation. She'll look at my face and call me blind. Greg, I'm not talking about the conversation. Then I'm talking about the way you were looking at her romantically and the way you were all flirting with her in my presence. Yes. Yes. Have you no shame? Babe, can you calm down? Hmm? Do you think I'll cheat on you? <laughs> well, you don't trust me anymore. I don't. To change on the daily. Because you're overthinking. Hey, calm down now. Mm -hmm. You know you're actually cuter when you're angry. Hmm? Do you want to stay? You want to stay angry? Do you, do you Who is laughing with you? Leave me. <laughs> well, babe, you know. Okay. Stay angry now. Like, Mom, I'm, I'm, I'm not. I'm not. Just, I'm not just, <laughs> Who is laughing with you? Back. You want to laugh with me now? <laughs> have deposited towards the cost of their wedding gone. Grace deposit gone. How do I explain this? I don't know. 
I don't understand. Like, you gave him the password to your debit card. How? 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 Where is he now? You can't do anything. I can do something because I will get that idiot arrested. Adora, where is he? I didn't ask you to do anything. Just leave him alone. What is going on? What's going on here? Adora, you're protecting this man. He, like, he practically turned you into a punching bag. He steals from you and you're still protecting him. It's what did he use for you? It's my mess. Oh, I will fix it. I'm just talking to you as a friend. I didn't say you should do anything. She's not even taking up her calls. Now return them. Who's that? Your wedding planner. <laughs> now she's my wedding planner. She, she could be busy now. Have you thought about that? Busy that she cannot even return her calls. Hmm? Hmm. Let it not be what I'm thinking now. And what are you thinking? <laughs> Give the girl a break, I beg. Has she ever disappointed you before? Have you called her and she didn't pick up before? So it could be anything. You know, she could be indisposed. She could actually be busy. Think about that now. You're just complaining. So you're actually calling me a nag, right? <laughs> wow. Maybe she's ashamed of flirting with my husband. He's very unprofessional. That is besides the point. Him. That is besides the point. What I'm saying is, think about other people. It's not always about you. Anything could have happened to you. What if she's sick? Have you thought about that? Be sensitive to other people's feelings now. <sighs> wow. It's been your hissing at now. Waiting now. See, but, but sincerely, Greg, with the way you're going, you get yourself into a very dark place that you may not be able to come up with. We were just catching up on old times, nothing serious. See, see, let's just stray with this whole Adora issue. You have a future right in front of you, and this future is with Anna Bell. You understand? I, I don't know. Really, I don't know if I can do this. Like, I feel incomplete without without Dora. Oh, really? Have you ever considered how your wife will feel? No, have you thought about how she would feel about all this? She's not my wife yet, no. See, bro, sincerely, I can't do this with you. You just need to get your head straight. Get your head straight. Also, I'm telling you, I don't know what to do. Trust me, you do. You know what to do. And you need to do it fast. I lost the 5 million naira deposit. How? Oh, I don't know. I, I just woke up to several debits. I don't even know. I don't know when. I don't know where. I don't know how. I, I don't know who. I just... Did you give your card to someone or something? Well, I... 
Oh man, this is four stars. Did you did you block your account? Yes. Did you I tell did. the police? No, I. Because if you don't block your account, they'll keep coming back. Yeah, I, 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 no, I blocked it. I just didn't know how to tell you. I. Oh, but you should have told me at least. I never be so worried. I'm sorry. I would come tomorrow and I'd explain things to her. No, that's not necessary. I'll, I'll give you back the money. No, no, no. No, please. I don't need you to give me the money. Dora, it's my mess. I will fix it. I will give you the money. Greg, okay. I said no. It's my problem and I will fix it. I will fix this. Michael, why are you doing this? Like, why do you choose to frustrate a girl who has done nothing but to love you despite your flaws? Why are you doing this? Why are you frustrating this girl? Why? I'm going to leave you out of your business. You loud mouth that bitch. The only time I will leave you is the time you will choose to leave her alone. Oh, yes. You're a shameless thief and a beast. I'm going to ah! your head now. It's the one in the place. You wanted to hit me with this? Michael, try it. You know, this is actually the second time you're trying to do this to me. <laughs> I swear the day you will try it, I swear with my life, the day you will try this, both of us will find out who will fuck the problem to the hospital. I'm telling you, you're a wicked soul. Like you stole the money a client gave to this girl for her job. Why are you this wicked? Why? What is wrong with you? I don't, I, I, I didn't take her money. So where did you get that narrative from? Tell that to Adora, not me. Keep lying to her, you cannot do that work. You know you don't have to accuse me wrongly. Oh, you think I didn't see you? I saw you at the mall with those girls. Of course, yes, I saw you. The night. Wait, are you serious? You saw me? Yeah. Okay. Did you tell? Did you tell Adora? She has a lot on her mind right now. And if you tell her it's only going to complicate things and pile up, and I'm not sure we are even ready for how to do it. The reason I'm going to go to the to you. Yeah. Don't say you want to go back. Excuse me! I will give you one round to see what you want to talk. You are so shameless. Do you want to bribe me to kill my friend? It's not a bribe, I'm just giving you two points. Just take the body and I will give you. She will never listen. You will never listen, Adora. She will never listen. What's your problem? What's your problem? Why won't you just stay out of my business? What was this? I told you I will find a way. Why are you coming here to harass him? How? How? How do you want to find a way out? Okay, you want to collect money from the bank. You don't have a collateral. The only thing you have is yourself. To think that that's that human being, but I don't want to call you an animal. Just watch your mouth. He tried to bribe me because I saw him with a woman. See? Now it makes sense. See? The only reason he will hide it from me, he will want you to hide it from me, is because he cares. He, he doesn't want to hurt my feelings. I don't know what's going on. What's going on with you? No, I, I, th I think that guy is doing something to you that you don't even understand. Listen, I just want peace. I'm tired of fighting. Okay. I spoke to an old friend. I told him about this and he said he was going to give you the money without a collateral. I'll stand at the door and talk. To work. I had to do it. I don't want you to look really stupid in front of your ex, your ex and his fiance. Just use the money to fix yourself. Just fix everything. I know you'll be fine. I appreciate you. Okay, I do. But your boots don't go. I ain't gonna stop. It's in your mouth. It's in my mouth. <laughs> I cannot mother. stop. I cannot stop. I won't stop. Go 
boy, I'm a mess. I feel like I'm having internal struggles. I'm about to make the most important decision in my life. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I'm making the right person, you know? Like, is she the right person for me? I'm not sure anymore, man. I don't know. Greg, the royal lover not so. You don't need to. Why are you to Adora? Adora is my first. My first love. Yeah, we've been through stuff together. She was carrying my child. If that accident didn't happen, by now my child would be like, what, five or six? Boy or girl? So, We've got history together, man. Yeah, I understand all that. But Adora is clearly taking advantage of this situation. Yes. No. <laughs> Adora telling you she lost your money to scammers is a deliberate attempt to no. either steal from you no. or jeopardize your wedding. Trust no. me. Bro, you don't know her. Adora is as straight and narrow as they come. She doesn't lie. She hasn't changed. She didn't offer that money. She refused. Yeah, I offered her the money back. She refused. If not my Annabelle now, she would on <laughs> now that can spend my money on anything. Mm -hmm. You're taking this too. <laughs> You're taking this too far. You're getting distracted. See, it was just focus on the wedding. Let's finish this wedding. Hmm? I will not allow you to disgrace me or everybody else. Focus on your wedding. I just feel like I'm rushing things, you know? Maybe I should pull back. Greg, you're not rushing anything. Just focus on your wedding. Focus on Annabelle. Forget Adora. Well, thank you. As I tried to surprise you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, as a maid of honor that I am, mm -hmm. I decided <laughs> to just surprise you and help you wrap things up. But then, you don't look happy. You look sad. <sighs> What's going on? I'm so happy you're here. Like, I'm already going mad. Mad? Yeah. Why would you be going mad? What? Like, your wedding is in a month and you're already going mad. What's going on, please? Tell me. What's okay. going on? I'm fine. It's just my wedding planner. She hasn't been picking up her calls. And Craig feels I should let her be. Let just her like be? That. Yeah. No, you don't let such people be. Like, why haven't you arrested her already? That's the thing with these people. So unprofessional. And it's annoying. Listen, girl, you really need to do something about this girl. If not, it's going to end up messing everything up for you. Yeah. Um, just that. I think going to the police is really not the right thing to, to do. I mean, the girl seemed nice. She seemed nice. It's not right to go to the police. Babes, listen. The most innocent looking snakes are the most dangerous snakes ever. If you don't do anything to her right, like right away, she's going to end up messing your wedding up. And by the time you realize it, it's too late. Right. Yes, right. <laughs> Convince you to talk to the police about this. This is such a small matter. Anna, anyway, what is this now without you telling me? It's not small. This is not small. Yes. It's not small. If you cannot pick up my calls on him, turn them. That girl is a thief. She's not! You don't even know what she's going through. How am I supposed to know? How am I supposed to know if she cannot explain things to me? Amanda, you see her? You have no right. No right whatsoever to have done this. That's what I'm telling you. Mrs. is my money. I can decide to get a second wedding planner. And I told you to be patient. Greg. What is going on between you and this lady? Why do you always defend her? Hello? I found her. 
I was the one who brought her to you to be our wedding planner. For God's sake, why do you always take sides with strangers with Benny? I'm not taking sides with strangers. What I'm saying to you is, you don't just go around calling people thieves. It's wrong. Then at the end of the day, you'll find out that you're wrong in this whole thing. How would you feel? But, I want to happen to our wedding. It's my not. We'll find a way around it. We will. I'm sorry. It's okay. I I'm sorry too for yelling, but then... Police? Madam Wendy, I don't know. Is she really good for you as a friend? Say I'm sorry. It's nothing, please. It's nothing. Just sit. Please. I'd rather not talk about it. Dora. You came here for a reason, right? Please, this. Dora, tell me what's going on. Please. Nothing is going on. This is just one of the many things that he does. This guy needs you. He does everything to hurt me. You know, if you ask me why am I still with this guy, I, I don't know. But you know me. I don't know how to double date. He pretended like he was there for me stayed with me after the accident at the hospital was there day night thought I was a good guy but I guess I was wrong so why are you still with him no, this is not you you I mean you've moved on why are you still with this guy maybe I trigger him trigger him I mean it hits you This guy's gonna have no, 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 Greg, 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 please, you don't want to do this. this. Fine. to you I'm fine I've got eyes now look at Stop. you I said I'm fine Greg, you get into I said I'm fine fight? I'm fine Greg Let's get ready for work Greg did you get into a fight Thank you. Yes, stop. 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 Stop.
So you said you said that it just happened to be true. No, I didn't. Right? I swear, I, I, I didn't, I didn't send anybody to hit you. What? I promise you, I didn't. Not not only did he hit you, did you have the guts to bring him to this house? But you had guts to lay oh stupid hands on me. You didn't mad, but the crazy. Okay, I didn't send anybody to you. Please, thank you. about that woman that doesn't sit right with me. Especially the way Greg reacts around her. Sorry, and I, I really don't get it. Are you... Are you saying that maybe he's having an affair with her? It's just a mere suspicion. That may not be right. Listen, girl, there's nothing like that, okay? If you feel or have a hunch that he's cheating on you, then girl, you have to follow it up. Because this could be your spirit trying to communicate something to you. Don't cry. He stopped being informed with me. Mindy, if I tell you, I don't even know the last time Greg touched me. That's crazy. He doesn't involve me in his personal life. I'm getting married to this man and I don't even know him enough. Can you believe he returned home yesterday with his t-shirt stolen? Like someone who just got out from a fight. What? Yes. The Greg I know is not a violent person. All of a sudden, he fights. This morning, he just had his back and left. Not even a word from him. Not even a word. I'm just speechless. So, this change started when he met with the wedding planner. You know what? It's fine. It's okay. All right? You were my friend. My best girl. And that means whoever messes with you has me to contend with. Okay? So, I've got you. All right? I don't know what to do. I love Greg. I love him. You know I love him, right? I know. I love him. Okay, listen. But it's all right. You'll be fine. Okay? I've got you. Just help me talk to Michael, please. He won't come out. He won't talk to me. He won't eat. He's just fixed in that room. Because he thinks I, I, I sent Greg to beat him up. Greg beat him up. Mercilessly. <laughs> Why are you laughing? It's not funny. Do you know how many painkillers he has taken? Stop. I'm telling you. Okay, I think I need to congratulate Greg. For what? For giving him the beating of his life. Oh, come on. Tell me, sir. 
make it happen. That's not important. Shouldn't even be laughing. Talk to him. I'm not. Can you just talk to him? You can beg this for all I can. Come, no. D. <laughs> No, please come in. Who are you? Who are you? Made of honor to the person whose money you stole instead of planning a wedding. What are you talking about? Annabelle! Steal from Annabelle. I would never steal from Annabelle. I know it sounds crazy, but I was defrauded. I'll never steal from any client. And you couldn't take any of her calls or return them. She's been worried sick that maybe something bad had happened to you. And here you are, living like you're not about to ruin someone's wedding that's in a month. I just thought it was important that I had everything figured out before I her. Really? Annabelle is a darling. I would never do anything to hurt her. Well, so you know that. You know she's kind. And that is why you're doing all these things you're doing to her. I'm sorry. We are sorry. Hey. Listen. You have just one week to make everything right. Trust me, you do not want to see me back here again. Because you will not like what I would do. I apologize. Whatever. There you have it. Parents just barge into your house. Eh? Wait, you don't want me to go in? I'm sorry. Are you hiding me now? Can you not make this difficult, please? I just don't want to make the situation worse. You guys already were in a fight. I, I don't need to trigger him. Please, I mean, regardless of what happened, he's my man. And I need you to respect him. So I'm the problem now? I'm not saying that, Craig. Please. Just don't oh, want no, to it's fine. I, I mean, this is what I came to give you anyway. Yeah. So you can complete the job. Quick, 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 quick. No, please. go back to him. He's your man, right? He keeps beating you, you keep going back to Craig, him. It's fine. Just... it's fine. Craig, I'm sorry. It's not. I'll call you. Don't call me. Where's your husband? At the office. Office, huh? <laughs> Let's not be what I'm thinking. What are you thinking? That he is lying, of course, and that your hunch has been right all along. Are you trying to say there's another woman? I'm not trying to say. I know there's another woman. And guess who the woman is? Your wedding planner. Yes. I tracked her down to her place earlier today. We talked, and when we were done talking, I left. When I was about leaving her place, 
I saw Greg, your Greg, pull up at her gate. I know. They won't do that to me. I got off the phone with Greg before you left and he told me that he won't be coming for lunch because he had an emergency in the office. Really? Yes. <laughs> he lied, obviously. He is having lunch with the other woman instead of you. And guess what? I saw them hug. It wasn't an ordinary hug. There was this familiarity in the hug. Trust me, it wasn't casual. Greg would never do that to me. No, he won't. He won't do that to me. So you don't believe me? No, like you don't believe your friend. Fine. I'll show you. Just hold on a bit. Here. Look at it. Do you recognize the picture? There's even a video. There you go. Oh, wait. I don't know. How did Greg do this to me? How would Greg do this to me? Planner. It's okay. My my wedding planner. It's ba <sighs> hey hey hey. Hold on, listen. It's fine. It's okay. Okay. Listen. Okay. We'll get through it. We'll get through it. And trust me, we're so going to make them pay for this betrayal. But it's okay. Just relax. That's enough. I can't do this. You'll be fine. I can't do this. It's okay. It's okay. Please. I can't. It's alright. Don't cry. Listen, listen, you'll be fine. Okay, you'll be fine. I'm here for you. I am here for you. It's okay, just stop crying. Alright? And I promise you, we are so going to make them pay for this betrayal. Okay? I can't, I can't do this anymore. It's okay. I can't continue. It's alright. I can't do this to me. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. boyfriend in the kitchen eating food. Mm. Okay, so why is your face like this? Greg gave me this. He was here. Mm -hmm. I didn't let him in because of my call. Six million naira. Placement for the money I lost. So long without support. You will not let this parasite spoil things for you. Please, you have to tell him to go. Call Greg right now and apologize. He will not pick my call. He makes you feel so. He left him so much anger. Can you just try, please? Because I don't want what happened to my girl to happen again. I don't trust my girl. How are you? Okay. What's going on with you? Whew. I knew it. I knew there was something with you and that wooden plan. I knew there was something going on between you two. It was right in my face. But I chose not to believe it because of the love I have for you. Hey, How could you do this please, to me, Greg? Calm down. I've never 
cheated on me. Okay, I was at her place, but to give her money to finish the job for the wedding plan. You lie. You a lie? big liar. How is it a lie? So, look at this. Explain this. What were you doing in her house if you have nothing to do with her, Greg? What is this? Is there anything here? There's nothing here. There's something there. Everything is wrong with this. Greg, why are you so wicked? Greg, you're so wicked and insensitive. You're wicked. Greg, after everything I've done for you, you're a dog. A very big one at that. Why are you, why are you talking to me this God way? will punish you, Greg. God will punish you. Okay, you know what? After everything, this wedding is on hold. What? I don't even know who I'm getting married to. The this wedding is. You know. Greg! Hey, babe. Please forgive me. Please, I beg you. Please. Find it a place in your heart to actually forgive me. I know I've wronged you. I know this is very difficult for you, but no vex. I beg, no reason. I'm anything to add on you. I promise to do right this time around. How many more times do I have to forgive you? Ten? Five? A hundred? Just this once. Just once. I beg, just this once, I beg. I promise you I will not fail you. Please. I beg, no vex, no reason now. I beg. And I love you. I'm done. You're what? Done. I'm done. You're done? Yeah. You're done? How? This can't never come without one now. Why? How can you be done just like that? For what? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, it's because of. It's because of that idiot, your ex, right? What's that stupid name again? Greg. And you think I don't know? I ran a background check on him. And I know that you've been sleeping with him. Oh yes, yeah, so you think I didn't know? And you all along, but I just, I forgave you, I pretended like nothing was happening. And this was the same thing you were doing, sleeping with different men, all in the name of wedding planning. So now tell me actually, what's the difference between you and hookup girls? And you come to tell me you're done just like that. My For what? Babe, are you serious? Dead serious. Hey, come on now. Come on. Come on. Babe, I beg. No vex. No vex. So. Michael, get out of my house! Call the guys. Why? What happened? Do I know this girl that I'm trying to get married to? Hmm? Okay, yeah, we've been dating for three months, but do I really know her? This is a lifetime commitment. This is what I'm going to get into. Now she's accusing me, always shouting, nagging me. I'm tired. I understand, but I need to come. Okay, so recently now she's accusing me of cheating. That I'm cheating on her with Dora. Okay, yeah, Dora, Dora, Dora is my friend. She's an old friend. We dated, fine. Does that mean I'm cheating on her? I, I, I can't help my friend anymore. Bro, you, you really need to calm down. You, you need to calm down. This is no matter of calming down. If this one is going to happen, not now. It's not going to happen now. Clearly not now. Um, what about the groups now? Call them, or I'll call them myself and I'll tell them. Always nagging me. What is it? He's, he's such a manipulator and a liar. <laughs> but the rage I feel right now, I might end up much with him if I see him. No, don't do that. Okay? You 
don't do that. It's all right. <laughs> but I can't believe that he ended things with you because of that woman. Like, this is the height of disrespect. Who does that? <sighs> you know what? It's fine. You can come live with me, all right? For as long as you want until you're able to get back on your feet. You didn't do anything wrong. What did I do? Nothing. Okay? Nothing. It's just it's just unfortunate. Alright? Please. I do that the same thing. It's fine. Of course you do. You do. It's fine. Alright. So is this the only bag you have? Yeah. Are you sure you checked properly to be sure you're leaving yeah. nothing with you? Yeah. Alright, please let's go. I'll help you with this, alright? Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Whoa, this is heavy. Annabelle. Annabelle, I'm homo. Annabelle. Annabelle, I'm home. is gone. <laughs> Alex Alpha. Do you know Annabelle is gone? What do you mean by she's gone? I just came home now. All her things. She's packed everything. She's gone. Yeah, I know I said, okay, wedding on hold, but then why would she just leave? What have I done wrong? What, what's my offense? Don't worry, I'll help you her. <laughs> I, I don't understand, man. I, I don't know. Calm down. I said I will call her. Whatever the case, I know that my conscience is clear. I didn't do anything wrong. I only helped my ex. Yes, yeah, she's my ex, but it could have been any other person. I would do the same thing. I would help. I just helped. That's all I did. Bro, I don't know, man. You can call her if you want to call her. Anything you want to do, it's okay. Meet her. Messages. I, I got no response. See, Annabelle, you really need to reconsider that decision you made. It's not good to make such decisions out of anger. If Greg wasn't cheating on you, I can tell you that for, for a fact. He was just helping his ex. He didn't cheat on you. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Those two were exes? And they lied all the while. They even told me they only met once. Dear Isis. Those eggs. Okay. Alex, let me ask you a question. 
Alex, do you want to tell me? To a brand as big as Adora's doesn't have a physical office that she only operates online? And your friend, Craig, had the F1 tree to visit her in her house. Huh? Um, it was just a harmless visit. See, you really need to fix your relationship. You need to, you need to fight for your mom. There's nothing to fix, Alice. And even if there was, this revelation has changed everything. I'm done. You guys are almost getting married. Think of the good times. You guys, you guys are in love. You're just going to throw, throw everything to the wind. There's nothing to talk about, Alex. I and Greg are over. We're done. So, you can leave. Thank you for coming. Oh, you think of what? What are you doing here? Let us not to the body for him. You follow me here. Why not? You think you can just crawl out from the way and you take my woman away from me? After abandoning her for so many years, and to do that without a fight, you must know if you have a lie, lie. Don't you dare play dumb. You just try and no reason. Don't give me that kind of leg. Where my woman is. And very rare, she'll say she's cheating for this house. She's not in her own house. Adora! 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 Where do you think you're you're shouting? My friend, get out of here! Adora! I'll call security. Back on the fear now. So I didn't worry. I will call security. Get out. You think you're wrong now, right? I'll come for both of you. Come on, Get me. out. And I won't, I'll have you. You think you can just make a fool out of me? Okay, get out. Get out, get out, and don't come back. If you know how happy I am that you finally met that idiot. <laughs> At least I don't have to be shouting again. <laughs> <laughs> your prayers have worked. <laughs> I'm telling you. Because you're free. Someone took pictures and sent it to her. What do you want to do? I'm calling her. You want to call her? Of course. It's an obvious mistake. Whoa, whoa. You need to call her immediately. Annabelle, hi. Annabelle, I promise you these pictures... She hung up. I told you, return their money back for them. We need to fix this. How? What do you mean how? I should be fixing their marriage, not ruining it. Just refund their money. It's a mistake. I will fix this. This is not about refund. Do you think there's going to be a wedding after this? You don't listen. Refund.
trying to set things straight. I do not want any misconceptions and I'm still waiting for Annabelle to come out. Uh -huh. I'd appreciate it also if you just henceforth let the communication go through your wife to be, please. Dora. You're still very nice and naive. Remember how we met in school? <laughs> I needed to print my assignments and I asked you for help. You gave me your last card. <laughs> and I remember starving for the rest of the week. Listen, I'm not here to chit chat. Would you kindly get Annabelle out? You're still very nice. And I see how you didn't want to hurt her. But she left me. She left you? Why? Why? Please don't tell me it's because of me. Listen, I, I, will, I can't. Why? Listen, Dora. She needs to it's know that there's nothing. It's always been you. Greg. Greg, please, I cannot be the cause of another woman's pain. Ever since you walked in through this house, everything changed. Jesus. Everything changed. It's always been you. You've always been by my side. This is not right. Yeah, this happened. But then, do I regret it? No. I don't know what you think, but I will not be the cause of another woman. Dora. Dora. Yeah, I presume you all the famous Annabelle. Greg's fiance. His ex. Oh. I have nothing to do with that guy anymore. Mm, I see. But what do you want? Go straight to the point and have time. Do you want to that? That bitch that you know like. I don't want to hear her name. You know. She was mine. Until that, I don't know, whenever it is, you were calling your ex or whatever it is. Until you came into her house and you even made her pray fast. Why are you telling me all this? Honestly, I'm not interested. And why do you still run after her? I mean, you're hot. And I guess women read. Be tripping for you. You, you think I'm hot? Yes, you are. Oh, I see. You're my number, right? Yeah. Why don't you call me? I will see how it goes. Mm, I love your single part. Yeah. I have a knack for bad boys. Mm. And you look like one. Are you? How about when I call you? When you link up, you get to phone me and say, I am one. <laughs> I want to. Okay. That sounds great. <laughs> but, Greg, you know this life is very funny. You know? A while ago, we were planning your wedding, thinking of how to shut the city down. But now here we are. No wedding. That's what it is, man. Um, have you tried getting in touch with Annabelle? Uh, at least to beg her. Nope. I'm not gonna beg her for anything. Um, so what's your plan? Plan is to bring the woman that I love into this house. And um, what if she doesn't want you? We'll see. Very funny.
first boyfriend, my first everything. Okay, really, this is the first time I'm saying this happy. Oh, please. It's true. What do you mean? So are you saying I'm always squeezing my face? No, not that, but you see this one is coming from the inside. Okay, now you're just exaggerating. I'm not, I, I'm not, you are. See how, like, like you look really beautiful when you smile. <laughs> <laughs> this girl. But it's true. Oh my God, I'm just, I can't believe it. I know. You never will be happy. What is going on? You've been crying since I got in here. <gasps> what? My God. I've squandered my money. All my expensive clothes and jewelry means he took everything. Jeez, are you serious? <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> like, how? <laughs> he wiped everything in my bank account and even took all my dollars. My God, he's gone. He's gone. He's vanished. My God, he's vanished. Jeez. Jeez. Oh my gosh. What do I do? What? What do we do? All my life savings, everything I've worked out for. Have you tried calling him? His phones are switched off. Oh my goodness. Oh no, 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 no. Like, I warned you. I really did. I warned you about this guy, but you wouldn't listen. No, he's gone. Everything I've worked hard for. <gasps> everything on my life savings. Everything. What do we do? Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. What do we do? I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't you know. know what? You know what? He couldn't have gone that far. Okay? Okay? We'll track him down. I'm going to get your stuff back. Alright? Do you get me? I can't make this It's okay. It's... How come I can't do this to it's everything so I've worked so hard for? You like it? I mean, uh, E for effort. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know, I know. Please see it. Thank you. <clears throat> okay, uh, so yeah, I I want us to just have a really cozy dinner. You know what I mean? Let me start with the wine. <laughs> then I'll take your order. <laughs> Did you cook this yourself? Oh yes, I did. Oh, I don't know if I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> don't, don't, don't play with me. E for effort, you said. Yeah. But trust me, it's A for effort this time around. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I know they don't make that much noise, you know, but then. I like this one. You like it? Yeah. What you do? I still, I still remember the things you like. You see. <laughs> Really do. I just want to do this real quick. Thank you. 